Welcome back. Um, we now would like to welcome Mr. Robert Niaga, who's from the Basara Center for Behavioral Economics. Welcome, Robert. Thank you so much. Is this your first trip to South Africa? Yeah, this is my first time in South Africa. That's fantastic. Really and it's the first African Social Marketing Conference. Yeah. yeah. So welcome. It's great to have you. Thank you so much. Can you tell us a little bit about your organization, what you do? Uh, thank you. So my name is Robert Nyaga. I am a technical lead at Busara Center for Behavioral Economics, and I lead the Qualitative Research and Design Unit at Busara. At Busara, we work with organizations and researchers to alleviate poverty in the Global South. In the Global South, we mostly work in India, Africa, Latin America, oh, but wow. obviously we work with organizations also in the Global North. That's interesting. Do you specifically concentrate on Africa, or do no. you move around the subcontinent, I mean the Southern Hemisphere? Uh, we have headquarters in Nairobi, but we definitely move across Africa. So we have projects across Africa. Have you got projects here in South Africa? or? Uh, we had one, currently we don't have one. Okay. Yeah. That's interesting. And is it your first social marketing conference? Yeah, this is my first social marketing conference. Uh, I used to attend, I'm also a member of International Communication Association. Right. So this is a natural fit for me. Absolutely. We've been blown away. I mean, the organizers have been blown away at the attendance, mm -hmm. as well as the, the quality of people that have visited. So yeah. it's great to, to have people of, of, of your sort of ilk. Um, what have you thought of the conference so far? I know it's only the first day, mm -hmm. but what, are you, what is your feedback? We, we're always keen to find that out. Uh, so it's been great. I've been to sessions in the morning and this afternoon. And to me, it's a moment to connect with researchers, to connect with practitioners, and to learn from the best. So, so far, so good for me. Oh, that's great. Yeah. What would you like to see? Obviously, they're looking at doing more of these conferences. Mm -hmm. I know they were looking at different venues or different yeah. locations. Mm -hmm. South Africa is a bit far from a lot of places. Nairobi seems to be one of the options. I'm sure you'd, yeah. you'd yeah. love to have the conference there. Sure. They're also looking at North Africa. Mm -hmm. So it's the proximity to Europe, obviously, the proximity to the rest of Africa. Nairobi seems to be a, a centre, cool. yeah. A lot of NGOs there, the UN is there. Yeah. I know. So what, what would you like to see at conferences? If there's anything you could add, I'm sure um, the organisers would love to know. Sure, sure. I think uh, we need to open it more so people know what social marketing is because it's bringing practitioners from across the board. So behavioral science, we have people from business school and people doing SBC work. So first of all, we need to make sure we're promoting the conference even more. But I think this is a good step now that we have a conference focused on Africa. So it's a good start. And obviously we want, uh, I think my recommendation would be for locations and venues to keep like located. Rotating, yeah, rotating, yes. Yeah, rotating across Africa. So we are not always coming to Africa and mopping. Maybe next time we should come to Nairobi. Some other time we could go to Nigeria. Some other yes, time correct. we could go to Morocco and other parts of Africa. Correct, I think that's their plan. Mm -hmm. I think also in the planning, and this was the first, so we weren't able to do it, but we do a lot of live streaming of events. Yeah, yeah. So the ideal scenario would be to have both the virtual event as yeah. well as the real live event yeah. um, so that more people, a far wider audience, can participate. Um, so part of what we're doing here, just so that the audience knows, is recording this so that we can share this content sure. um, with those who can't attend and moving on to other conferences, do the same. Because clearly the, the message is around social marketing and the value it yeah. brings to the community. Yeah, and I believe that uh, hybridity, having virtual and in-person events will allow more people to attend events and especially people who are not able to attend because of work schedules or just the expense of in-person conferences. So that's a good step. And yes. I believe it will accommodate more people. And the networking opportunities are yeah. fantastic. Sure. We've met some wonderful people here. I'm sure you have as well. Yeah, I have. Great. Yeah. Robert, thank you very much. Thank you so it much. It was a pleasure time. having you and I hope you enjoy the rest of the conference. Yeah, pleasure too. Thank and you, Mr. Uh, Robert Nyaga. Yeah.